Hey, I'm Todd Brown, and I make these videos because I want you to rip on race day. He hates it, but he loves it. And you know what? So do I. I get it. I've said this before. There is only one way to be great. Nowhere was that better captured than last week when the great Wout Van Aert said, I hate it, but I love it. Now, was he talking about interval training? I hate that. Intermittent fasting, I don't really love that. Bike hygiene, sometimes I wish I just had a, a porter that would receive my bike and get it all buffed out and then give it back to me, but I don't. So, And he wasn't talking about any of those either. It was his loss, his loss, at the UCI World Championships to his arch rival, Matthew Vanderpool. If you didn't see the race, it's epic. Highly recommend you look it up. At least look up the last lap because it is a battle. Uh, what do they say? A battle royale. Anyways, it was an awesome battle and I could feel the, the pain and the hope, right? You could see the hope that each rider had. They were each hopeful, thinking that they could do it if everything went right. Um, so why would Walt love it? A stinging loss at the line, literally at the line. And think about what the great T.S. Eliot penned long ago. The journey, not the destination matters. So how do we achieve greatness? We go on a quest. If we're lucky, like Wout, we find a worthy opponent who extracts not the very best of us, but all of us. This is why Wout hates it and loves it. When we go on a quest, it's a hell of a lot more than just finishing or standing on the podium or winning, even winning a crapshoot sprint. The finish line, that's already a known and it's already a given. What are we willing to do to get there? That is the journey. Hey everybody, these podcasts and vlogs are new for Pedal Industries, so if you're enjoying them, please like and subscribe and share with your friends. Thanks so much. Keep challenging yourself.